Contemporary Slavery Unmasking the Hidden Chains In the 21st century, the term slavery may conjure images of a bygone era characterized by the transatlantic slave trade and the American Civil War. However, slavery persists in our world today, albeit in a different and more insidious form. Contemporary slavery, also known as modern-day slavery, is a global human rights crisis that affects millions of individuals worldwide. This video explores the various facets of contemporary slavery, shedding light on the hidden chains that continue to bind countless victims. The Many Faces of Contemporary Slavery Contemporary slavery takes many forms, adapting to the economic, social, and political landscapes of different regions. Some of the most prevalent manifestations include 1. Forced labor, one of the most common forms of contemporary slavery, forced labor, ensnares people in industries such as agriculture, construction, manufacturing, and domestic work. Victims are coerced or deceived into working under exploitative conditions with little or no pay, often trapped by debt bondage. 2. Human trafficking. Human trafficking involves the recruitment, transportation, harboring, or receipt of individuals through force, coercion, or deception for the purpose of exploitation. Victims of human trafficking are subjected to various forms of slavery, including sexual exploitation, forced labor, and child soldiering. 3. Child labor. Millions of children worldwide are subjected to child labor, robbing them of their childhood and education. They are often forced to work in hazardous conditions, with little or no access to health care and education. For bonded labor, bonded labor, also known as debt bondage, occurs when people are forced to work to repay a debt. In many cases, the debt is exaggerated or impossible to repay, effectively making them modern-day slaves. 5. Child soldiers, armed groups and militias recruit children as young as 7 or 8 years old to serve as soldiers, often using brutal tactics to control and indoctrinate them. 6. Forced marriage. Forced marriage is a form of contemporary slavery where individuals, predominantly women and girls, are married against their will. They are often subjected to physical and sexual violence and have limited autonomy. Root Causes of Contemporary Slavery. Contemporary slavery thrives in environments marked by poverty, inequality, conflict, and corruption. Some of the key factors contributing to its persistence include 1. Poverty. Poverty is a significant driver of contemporary slavery. Vulnerable individuals, desperate for income, are more likely to fall victim to exploitation when offered employment opportunities that seem promising. 2. Lack of education. Lack of access to education perpetuates the cycle of slavery. Illiterate and uneducated individuals are more easily manipulated and are less aware of their rights. 3. Discrimination and marginalization. Discrimination based on race, ethnicity, gender, or caste increases vulnerability to slavery. Marginalized communities are often more susceptible to exploitation and abuse. 4. Armed conflict. Areas affected by armed conflict are breeding grounds for slavery. Displacement, lawlessness, and the breakdown of social structures create an environment ripe for exploitation. 5. Weak legal frameworks. Inadequate legal frameworks, lack of enforcement, and corruption enable perpetrators to operate with impunity, making it difficult to combat slavery effectively. 6. Global supply chains. The globalization of supply chains can inadvertently foster slavery. Companies may unknowingly source products or raw materials produced using forced labor, contributing to the problem. The fight against contemporary slavery. Addressing contemporary slavery requires a multifaceted approach involving governments, civil society, businesses, and individuals. Some critical steps include 1. Strengthening legal frameworks, governments must enact and enforce laws that criminalize all forms of contemporary slavery and ensure that victims have access to justice. 2. Raising awareness, education and awareness campaigns can help individuals recognize the signs of slavery and report suspicions. 3. Supporting vulnerable communities' efforts to alleviate poverty, improve access to education, and reduce discrimination can reduce vulnerability to slavery. 
For holding corporations accountable, businesses must conduct due diligence in their supply chains to identify and eradicate forced labor and exploitation. 5. International cooperation, collaboration between nations is essential to combat trafficking and transnational slavery effectively. Problems with the term modern slavery. The term creates a hierarchy of human exploitation, focusing on extreme cases rather than everyday forms of dehumanization and inequality. Politicians may use the term selectively, diverting attention from comprehensive human rights issues. Clarity in defining and addressing different forms of exploitation is crucial for effective problem solving. Some academics argue against using the term modern slavery, but charities and local governments continue to use it. Modern slavery is categorized into subcategories like human trafficking, sexual exploitation, criminal exploitation, and forced labor. These categories often overlap, making it complex to address modern slavery effectively. The UK utilizes a referral system called the National Referral Mechanism to identify potential victims of modern slavery. Thus, contemporary slavery is a dark stain on our modern world, hidden in plain sight but affecting millions of lives. It is a complex issue with deep-rooted causes, but it is not insurmountable. By acknowledging its existence, raising awareness, and taking concrete actions at the local, national, and international levels, we can work together to unmask the hidden chains and eventually eradicate contemporary slavery from our society. The Case of Bristol Bristol's Historic Links to Slavery Bristol was a major port for the slave trade in the 17th and 18th centuries. Families who benefited from the slave trade have buildings and landmarks named after them in Bristol. The University of Bristol also has benefactors who profited from slave trading. The university is now investigating its links to the city's slave trade history. The government estimates that there are approximately 10,000 victims of modern slavery in the UK. Slavery in the UK Charities argue that slavery in the UK is at an all-time high, with numbers increasing between June 2018 and 2019. The Samaritans supported 2,251 potential victims during this period. 48% of these victims had experienced labor exploitation, while 39% had experienced sexual exploitation. Prosecution for modern slavery cases is not always easy. Around 68% of prosecutions for adults end in conviction, while only around 50% end in conviction for children. Lack of sufficient evidence often hinders prosecution efforts. Case Study, Human Trafficking and Forced Labor a couple from Bristol was found guilty of human trafficking and forced labor over a period of 10 years. They had kept over 40 Slovakian immigrants captive in a house and forced them to work in a car wash, subjecting them to abuse. Modern Slavery Legislation The Modern Slavery Act was introduced in 2015, providing more support for survivors and establishing an independent anti-slavery commissioner. However, there has been a decline in legislation supporting survivors since then. The slavery industry is one of the fastest growing international crimes. It is estimated to bring in approximately $150 billion annually.